Welcome to Switched On Schoolhouse, a CD-ROM based homeschool curriculum from Alpha Omega Publications. In Switched On Schoolhouse 3rd Grade Science, your students will study units that cover general science topics like you grow and change, animals growth and change, properties of matter, time and seasons, heat energy, and much more. Now let's take a look at a third grade science lesson to see how concepts like these are covered. In a unit entitled Plants, let's look at a lesson called Plant Parts. Most Switched on Schoolhouse lessons begin with a brief introduction and a list of objectives for the lesson. These objectives help students stay focused on important lesson content and provide parents with an effective way to measure mastery of lesson content. At the beginning of most lessons, your students will also encounter a list of vocabulary words that will be used throughout the lesson. We've included several activities to encourage mastery of these important words. For example, students can hear the correct pronunciation of each word. Breathe. Celery. In addition, the vocabulary arcade games encourage mastery of the vocabulary words by providing practice in the correct spelling of each word and in matching each word with its definition. Let's look at a sample. Flashcards allow students to easily review the words and their definitions. A variety of audio-visual presentations, including videos, slideshows, and animations, provide reinforcement of lesson content. Animations, like this one, may help your students better understand difficult concepts. In this animation, notice the red coloring moving up through the plant. This represents the water and minerals moving through the plant as the roots take them up. The tiny tubes in the stem transport them to the upper parts of the plant. And finally, they make their way to the leaves where food is manufactured for the plant. More than 25,000 engaging multimedia activities have been included in Switched On Schoolhouse lessons and are designed to engage student interest and bring learning to life. The addition of these interactive activities encourages learning by allowing students to become actively involved in the lesson presentation. Yuck! Am I really eating roots, stems, and leaves? Hi, I'm corn. I'm a seed. Hi, I'm a carrot. I am a root. Hello, I'm celery. I'm a stem. Some lessons contain multiple sections. After reading the first section of the lesson, the student can continue on to the next section, reading the text and utilizing the included multimedia. In some lessons, students are given the opportunity to review and reinforce what they've learned with fun games like Farmer Frank and All Right. Let's take a look at an example. At the end of the lesson, the student is presented with a series of questions that provide a review of lesson content. Questions are presented in a variety of formats, including matching, fill in the blank, true and false, sequencing, multiple choice, multiple select, click and place, essay questions, and many more. 
Eighty-five to ninety percent of student work is graded instantly by the program. Good answer. Answers are automatically saved as the student works through the questions, and immediate feedback is given after each question has been answered. Correct. If a parent has set the program to allow for multiple attempts, students will be looped back through the lesson to answer questions that were marked wrong on the first attempt. Good answer. The lesson is complete when all questions have been answered correctly or when the student has exhausted his allowed attempts on each question. The student can then return to the home page to continue through the rest of his daily assignments.